I have here the 2022 Pinot Noir Rosé. This is the first year we've been able to do an actual varietal rosé, which we're really excited about. So this rosé is going to be just very reminiscent of a Provence rosé, if you will, just by that lighter color. It has a lot of interesting nuances in terms of the aroma. Lots of orange peel, some strawberry essence. It's a great wine to have during the summer or, or with just about anything. Uh, I encourage you to try this out and just compare it to other Pinot Noir rosés that you've had. And we're really happy with this and I hope you enjoy it as well. I have here the 2022 Aurora Sauvignon Blanc. This is one of my favorite wines to make year in, year out, just because it changes so much and it's reflective of the vintage. Sauvignon Blanc is just, uh, it's, it's exciting to make, it's exciting to drink, everything about it I love. Um, it has all sorts of interesting nuance to it that you don't find in any other wine. It has a lot of these interesting, just lemongrass and kiwi notes alongside this grassiness that's very distinctive. Um, it's just one of my favorite wines and I, I hope you enjoy it as well. I have here the 2022 Medium Sweet Cabernet Strameter. This wine was sold out for a while, so we're excited to actually get this back. Uh, Cabernet Strameter is a wine that does really well in Michigan. It grows really well. And we decided to make this medium sweet to really bring out how lush it is. It can go with so many different things and it's fun to pair with a variety of foods. One thing that I really love about Cabernet Strameter is it has really unique aromatics. The, the rose and lychee that are prominent in it just really make it exciting to pair with all sorts of dishes. Uh, I know people love to pair this wine, but they also love to drink it on its own. I encourage you to try it with just about anything and with anyone. Twenty twenty two Pinot Blanc. This wine is new for Aurora Cellars, and we're excited to keep releasing this into the future so that people can taste all the different vintages. Pinot Blanc is a very transparent wine. It shows the, the growing conditions, it shows how it was made. This wine is really fun. It, it's, it can go with a variety of things, but it also has some nice subtle aromatics to enjoy on its own. Pinot Blanc can be a bit of an underrated wine, but frankly, I, I enjoy its subtle nature. It has a lot of just nice subtle pear notes as well as some apple and some melon. Um, this wine is just one of my favorite wines to make and I hope you enjoy it. This is the 2022 Ottawa. It can be a bit of a pain to pronounce as well as when you see it spelled, but this wine is traditionally a, it's something that's actually blended in with Pinot Blanc. You'll see it out in the Alsace. It's a, it's a fantastic white wine. It just hasn't really caught on everywhere. So we decided to actually hold some separate from our Pinot Blanc this year and give people a chance to actually see what this variety is like on its own. It actually has some really nice, subtle peach and melon notes, and I'm hoping people will actually get a chance to enjoy it and they can see it in the Pinot Blanc in the future. We might not always have this wine independently, so this is a great chance to get to see what this wine is like on its own.